to another episode of Just Cook It with me. Today we'll be making a banana pudding cake. And these are the ingredients you'll need. Milk, vanilla wafers, vanilla cake, whipped cream, butter, eggs, and vanilla pudding. And don't forget the bananas. It wouldn't be a banana pudding cake without bananas. So let's get started. Okay, now we're gonna get started on this vanilla cake first. Put the vanilla vanilla cake in, in the bowl. Then we have the three eggs. A cup and one-fourth of water and the butter I don't use oil I like to use the butter so I'm going to mix it up all right so welcome back now we're about to get start on the vanilla pudding so now put your vanilla Inside the bowl, milk, that's two cups, and you stir it until fine. I'll probably stir it for a while. It's kind of firm now. Do you see it's like kind of getting firm? I'm going to add my whipped cream. Because it's just like frosting on a cake. So now I'm going to add the whipped cream to the filling. And I'm going to whisk it in. Stir it. See how it's getting thicker now? It's just like gonna be, it's gonna be the frosting of the cake. Okay, now the pudding is done. I'm about to refrigerate it so it can be cold for the top of the cake. Be back in a moment. Now I'm going to prepare my first layer of cake. Got my cold, put it out of the refrigerator, and I'm going to just scoop it on like frosting. Okay, so now I'm going to put the bananas on top. And the, the cookies that we crunched up. Mm -hmm. So 
this is the middle, I mean the bottom layer of the cake. Okay, so this is the first layer. We're going to do the, the next layer. So now I'm finishing up with my banana pudding cake. I'm just putting the bananas on top. Then I'm going to put some more cookies. I'm going to put some cookies up there just to make it look really pretty. Move that up a little bit to make it look pretty. But this is my banana pudding cake. What do you think? Does it look good? Does it look eatable? It was pretty fun though. Just, you know, trying something I've never tried before. My mother-in-law makes banana pudding all the time, but I'm not really a banana eater, so she always makes mines without bananas, me and Al's without bananas. So. Here's my rendition of a banana pudding cake. And I'm gonna crunch some crunchies all over it just to make it look really, really nice. And I'm really going out the box by putting all this stuff over my counter, my counter. I could have just used my hand and put them on, but here's my rendition of a banana pudding cake. All right, guys, I think that's the best side, though. All right, thanks for watching. Just cooking. Okay, welcome to another episode of Just Cooking. On this episode, we are tasting. Banana pudding cake. So we have Al, Al, and Vaughn. So go ahead, guys. Taste it. It's different. I never thought that combination would will work but the cake is very good it's very moist <laughs> move it right along uh it's good okay guys good guys good okay good deuce this is good i love it very much okay all right so what do you give it oh. al al and vaughn two thumbs up two thumbs up two thumbs up oh. <laughs> It's not as uh, sweet as I thought it was going to be either. I thought I would need some. With my end results. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye. Try it at home.